Hello, welcome to Storytime with Judy. Our book today is Heart in the Pocket by Lawrence Bourgeonon and illustrated by Valerie Deher. Well, this little kangaroo, he likes it right in his mama's pocket. And he tells her it's because he can feel her heart down there and hear her heart down there. He never wants to leave it. But she tries her best to get him to come out and be adventurous. Let's see if she finally gets him to. Mama Kangaroo loves her little Jojo a lot, lot, lot. She sings him sweet songs. She gives him beautiful desert flowers. And she gently rocks him to sleep in her pocket. Mama shows Jojo all the beauties of the desert. The wild wind dancing in the sand. The small bird nesting in the mahogany tree. A butterfly gliding on the breeze. And a floating cloud in the blue, blue sky. Wouldn't you like to be a floating cloud, Mama asks. Not me, Jojo says. The wild wind will blow that cloud far away. I want to stay in your pocket where I'm safe and warm. But if you were the wild wind, says Mama, you could travel far and wide. You could see things that you have never seen before. Oh no, said Jojo. The wind is always blowing. It never stops to rest and it doesn't have a home. I want to stay in your pocket where I can sleep and dream whenever I want. You could be a bird, Mama says. Birds are free and can fly far, far away. But they can always come home to their cozy nest high in the mahogany trees. Oh no, Jojo says. A nest isn't soft and warm like your pocket is. And your pocket jumps, dances, and rocks me to sleep. What about a butterfly, Mama says. Butterflies are soft and ever so light. They float on the breeze and know how to find the prettiest desert flowers. Mama, you know where all the flowers are, says Jojo, and you know how to find water hidden in the desert and the green, green grass that we love to eat. I want to stay in your pocket so we can do everything together. Hmm, Mom, says Mama, what if you were a lizard? You could draw rivers and birds and flowers in the sand with your long lizard tail. I can already draw a look. <clears throat> Jojo leans out of the pocket and uses his big stick to make a figure in the sand. See, it's a mama kangaroo and a baby in her pocket. The baby will stay in the pocket forever so he can always hear his mama's heartbeat. Ah, I see, my little Jojo, did you know that my heart is not in my pocket? My heart is up here, Mama says, pointing to her chest. If you climb a little higher, you will hear it beating. Jojo slowly creeps out of the pocket. Then he stands on his tippy toes and falls right into his mother's arms. There you are, my little kangaroo. See, it's not so bad outside the pocket. Mama kisses his nose, his eyes, his chin, all the fingers on both hands, and Jojo's two big funny feet. Jojo giggles. Put me down, Mama. Mama gently places him on the sandy ground. The wild wind blows, the birds sing in the mahogany trees, the butterflies dance on the breeze, but there isn't a cloud in sight. Where did the clouds go, Jojo asked. Far, far away, little one. Let's go chase them. And they leapt with the wind across the sand. Mama Kangaroo loves her Jojo a lot, lot, lot. She sings him sweet songs. She finds him beautiful desert flowers. And she will always hold his heart in her pocket. Well, Jojo didn't want to come out of that pocket, did he? He likes being with Mama. But someday Jojo will get too big for that pocket, won't he? We'll see what happens. I hope you enjoyed the story and don't forget to subscribe and like. See you tomorrow. Thank you.